Welcome back everyone, Ryan with the Idaho Crypto Group here, today with a how to set up a Coinami wallet. So again, a cryptocurrency wallet is somewhere where you store your coins or tokens. There are apps, there are wallets on your computer. There's also physical wallets and there's even paper wallets. But today we're gonna to show you how to set up a uh, mobile wallet on Coinami and also a desktop wallet on Coinami. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and take my face away and let's hop right into it. So you're going to start off by going to our website right here at idahocryptogroup.com. And if you scroll down a little ways right here where it says uh, crypto tools, right in the top right, there's going to be crypto wallets. You're going to go ahead and click on the picture there. And then right here in the top middle, you can see desktop and phone wallet, Coinami. Uh, there's also Tron wallet, Exodus wallet, as well as physical storage wallets, cold storage, and all of that. We'll have videos for all of those later, but for today, we're going to focus on Coinami. So once you click there, it's going to take you to their main page where it says download Coinami. And again, you can do this on your mobile device, whether you have an Android or an uh, iOS device, either way. Uh, and again, uh, the, the setup is going to be basically the same on mobile or desktop. I'll have screenshots for the mobile version as well. And so right here, if you're using Windows, you're going to download there, Linux, uh, Apple, Mac right here. Uh, I'm using Windows today, so I'm going to go ahead and hit download and go ahead and skip to when it finishes downloading. Okay, so once it's done downloading, you're gonna go ahead and open up the download file. Okay, and then you're gonna go ahead and accept the uh, license agreement and choose the folder you'd like to store it in. Create a desktop shortcut, always nice if you're using a desktop version, and install. And then you are gonna go ahead and launch the Coinami wallet. Alrighty, so here we are. Welcome to Coinami. It's going to look basically the same on when you open up your mobile app. So you're going to have the option to create a new wallet or restore a wallet. So today we're going to be creating a new wallet. So you're going to go ahead and click that. And then it's going to give you a wallet recovery phrase. Okay, so this isn't your password, but this is your recovery phrase. It's basically like the cryptocurrencies world uh, um, use of a security question. Instead of having you answer what street you grew up on or your mother's maiden name, it's going to give you this um, string of words here. So um, you're not going to want to screenshot and store these on your computer or your phone. Uh, devices are always susceptible to having information leaks. So you're definitely going to want to write these down somewhere and store it in a secure your location that you only know the um, way to get to because with this phrase you can get directly into your wallet so you're gonna go ahead and write that down somewhere and then once you get it written down you are going to check the box that says I have safely stored my recovery phrase and you're gonna go ahead and hit next okay and then it's gonna have you confirm your recovery phrase right here to make sure that you did write it down correctly so I'm gonna go ahead and do that real quick and then hit next. Okay, and now you're gonna set up an actual password. Now, um, this is a password that you um, will use to do most of your signing into the general app. Um, again, the recovery phrase is if you forget your password. Okay, now it's gonna give you the option to select the coins that you want in your wallet. Now, um, so you, you know, you've got Bitcoin, you've got Bitcoin Cash, you've got uh, Bitcoin, Bitcoin SV, You've got all sorts of different coins here, and again, you can always add more later, so I'm just gonna go ahead and hit Bitcoin for now, and hit Next. Okay, and then here's some more terms of service, the legal disclaimers, and all of the risk statements. Gonna go ahead and hit Accept. And then boom, on desktop, this is gonna look like the general overview of your wallet. Now on mobile, uh, it's gonna look a little bit more like this over here on the side. Um, but so again, you can see the coin that you selected and then if you added more coins, they would all be listed below. Okay, and so this is the overview page. So if you click on Bitcoin, it's gonna show you your balance, whether you have any or not, as well as your currency value, US dollar here where we are. And uh, yeah. Again, all the other coins would be listed here. Super simple, guys. Uh, and again, mobile setup is basically the same. Mac setup will look basically the same. And make sure to watch the next video as well where we're going to show you how to make transactions on the wallet itself. Thanks, guys.